everybody for Clover 18 here today with, with an exclusive Lego set review and it's this 2014 White Spaceman. This set was only available to people who spent $75 or more in September during Lego Shop at Home's month and it is very cool. This set comes with 19 pieces. It does not have a set number. The ages is 6 plus. It comes with kind of too many figures. That's the really only part to the set. And one of them, of course, is being the white classic Spaceman. Lego this year, or Lego last year in 2014, brought back the Lego blue Spaceman with the Lego movie and Benny, of course. But this, and then they also later in the year, I'm thinking it's 2014 still, but later in the year, 2014, they brought back the white classic Spaceman. So it is very cool, and I've decided to review this set for you guys today. Let's take a look at the set now. The first part of this set is what I'm going to talk about today, and it is actually the set part with the most pieces in this set. It is this little robot. The robot here is designed to move its arms up and down. It can bend over, because that's what it's made for. It can bend over, and it does have movable antennas. It looks the, um, pretty similar from the back here, except it does not bend this way, and the arms are facing the front. Very cool. I think it's supposed to be a space robot. I'm not sure. You can let me know in the comments below if you think that's what it's supposed to be, but I think it's what it's supposed to be. And it is just, it's a really cool little space creature that I would never have thought of to build. Just the way some of the parts are used, it's, it's pretty neat. I, I really like it. And of course, the part you've all been waiting for, the actual classic space minifigure. So this classic space white minifigure has the classic space logo printed on the front of his torso. The rest is all the pants. Everything is white except the head. It's just the classic smile, one of the very first smiles LEGO came up with. And the helmet. The helmet, unfortunately, is not the old style helmet. It's the new style where the grooves are for the visors. LEGO didn't change that like they did for Benny. And on the back here we have the Lego um, space tank, very similar, just a lot shinier than I remember for the classic space, but that's also because the classic space that I've been exposed to was my dad and my uncles, so it is very dirty because they played with them for their whole childhood. But I do have some white classic space minifigures that definitely don't look as nice as this one. This one obviously because it is brand new. These two minifigures and slash space builds together I think look really cool. They just look like, you know, good friends that have met each other on space and I just like them. I think, I know I try and keep my reviews unbiased but when I get a special edition set like this I just can't do it because this set is so cool and I think these two people together are just so great. Normally in my LEGO reviews, I don't show the box or the instruction manuals because, you know, the instructions just tell you how to build the set. They can be found online, as well as all these box images can be found online or in your stores. It's really the review that you guys care about. But because this is such a cool box and you don't get to see the inside, I'm going to show you both the box and the instruction manuals. Here is what the box looked like. The box looks like. It has a bunch of the classic spacemen the vintage spaceman as well as coming up to the more recent spaceman. It's got the picture of the set, 2014 logo, it's got the uh, studs all the way around. Here it says 6 plus, 19 pieces, Lego. At the very top here it's continued the stud pattern and it actually has the old Lego logo. On this side it's got 2014 as well as the old Lego logo. On the bottom there is nothing. On the side, it is the same as the other side, and then just on the back, there's the, you know, the disclaimer and blah, 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 blah. Open that up here, and this is the actual cool part that I like a lot. It is actually just a sleeve. So this is what the inside looks like. It's got the old, it's got the classic, old classic base logo with the gold, as well as studs all the way around, the new LEGO logo, the new LEGO logo again, classic space continued on the back and the old Lego logo on all sides. This is very, oh, it's upside down. It is very cool. I like to use it in my Lego room to display it. This set, I just put, I actually put a uh, plate, a white plate in here, you never know the difference, and put these two on it, just keeps them standing straight and together, and it looks very cool to display this set. And as I mentioned, it just goes back in, just like a little sleeve. 
and it is very cool. The instruction manuals, they're also very cool. Here's what the instructions look like. First things first, it just it doesn't even tell you where to dump your bags, it just shows you how to build it, and then it actually is like a catalog of all these vintage space sets along with their set numbers, which are shown on the box or in the pictures, and their year. And it's just very cool because it, it throws you back to some history sets from 1980s, 90s, 1990s, and it's just very cool. And it even brings you up to the, some of the more modern 2007, 2009, 2013 sets. And then at the back here, it gives you a quick brief look at all the classic space leading up to the normal space minifigures that we have today. And then on the back, it's just got this cool little animation of the set. Very cool instruction manuals and very cool box. Definitely collector additions to this set. I think the set is great. Not many play features because it is such a small set. 19 pieces, smaller than most poly bags actually, but I'm really glad we didn't get this set in a poly bag. As I mentioned, the box is very collectible with the really cool instruction manuals. And this set is just re looks really cool on a display in your Lego room, in your living room, in your bedroom, wherever you keep your Lego. I think this is a really cool set. It was definitely worth spending the $75. Not that I did it, I got it for Christmas as a present. But it was a, it's a very cool set and I knew I wanted it very much when I first saw it in the like release pictures. Thanks a lot for watching this video of this review. No set number, I tell it to you. This set is ages 6 plus with 19 pieces and was an exclusive 2014 set available when you spent $75 or more in Lego Shop at Lego Shop at Home. Thanks a lot for watching. I hope you share this video with your friends, like this video, comment on this video, and of course subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a great day.